This is Bobby House the Third. Are you struggling in your youth ministry with any different type of things? Well, this video right here, ladies and gentlemen, will help you to overcome those things with the Word of God. <laughs> youth worker's job never ends. There's always another student to visit. Another event to plan! Another lesson to prepare. Another family to help. Another campus to visit. Another book to apply. Can it all be done? Guys! This looks like a job for love! Joy! Peace. Patience. Kindness. Goodness! Faithfulness. Gentleness. Self-control! By your powers combined, I am Doug Fields! Oh, Doug Fields, you're just the right guy. How do I keep from burning out? I'm back here. Well, Pastor Gabe, God has wired me with the ability to keep a fast pace, and I'm comfortable with that. I've juggled college, seminary, and full-time ministry since 1979. Well, let me give you several steps, 12 steps if you will, to keep from burning out. Step number one, act your age. Hey, stop that. How did we get here? Step number two, practice saying no. No! 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 Stop that! Step number three Learn to confront. Wow! Step number four Talk to other youth workers. Hi, I'm Caleb Davis, and I'm another youth worker. Step number five. Have accountability with people outside of the ministry. We're your accountable friends outside the ministry. Look, a construction worker. A lumberjack. Step number six, find a caring mentor. Step number seven, block out a day off. Step number eight, block out your vacation. Step number nine, control your time or others will control it. Finally, step number 12, keep track of your time. I'm keeping track of my time. Thank you, Doug Fields. You're welcome, Pastor Gabe. My work here is done. I'm on to other churches. So long.
And remember those 12 steps. Stands to 